Okay, so we uh, used a little blue to flatten out that big pile of um, it's like crushed rock, I guess. And we built a little pad you can see over my shoulder here. It's uh, just for some drainage under the tent. I didn't want it to get wet and then stay wet. So, uh, so we've got uh, one of the decks built. Uh, the tent's going to be sitting on three decks uh, all put together. It was just easier than building one giant one so we're just building three and then connect them together uh, after we're done we'll be able to turn them into maybe one can be Austin's cabin one can be my tool shed and we'll see we'll, we'll reuse everything though nothing's gonna go to waste so yeah the, the bottom one's done we didn't film that because um, well you don't want to see me put in screws and take screws out we made made some mistakes redid some stuff we're not carpenters uh, we're getting better, but um, doing our best. So that's uh, the first deck's dead level, nice and square. So we're just uh, starting the process of building the second one on top. So that's the second one. Uh, we're just building it upside down actually at the moment, and then we'll flip it over. Um, but it's nice to have, now that the bottom one's done, we've got a nice level uh, workbench to work from. So. This is, uh, what is this? This is 10 by 16, and there's three of them, so it'll be uh, 30 by 16 when we're done. Um, each one's getting nailed, nailed from the end, and then we've got uh, joist hangers on each one. Uh, that's the process we're just working on at the moment. And then we'll, we'll sheet it, uh, flip it upside down, and put the insulation in. And then we put the floorboards on with some poly. Or use this pink. Pink Panther insulation. It's weird stuff. It uh, looks like cotton candy and it actually smells like cotton candy. It's so weird. Um, but it's not quite as itchy, I think, as the old stuff used to be. And that's our storage tent. So that's, that's the one we used to be sleeping in. Um, but we pulled the, there's like a little inner tent inside of it. So we pulled that out. And now it's just full of stuff. And, uh, now me and Pam are able to, to sleep in our little trailer. That's the trailer we're sleeping in again. So it's nice to have a, an actual mattress instead of an air mattress. My back doesn't do air mattresses. Um, yeah, so that's where we're at here. Uh, hopefully before this video goes out, we'll, we'll have the full deck done. We'll show you what that looks like. pieces are, are this way. Then you'd be cutting every piece.
Oh shit. We got another joist to put in here. Uh -huh. Crazy. Yeah. Oh my God. This is Pam's number two carpenter hair clip. <laughs> Seems to do the job. <laughs> That board's crooked, huh? It's not even lined up. Better not wreck my kit. Pretty good. Look at the fine job the work crew's doing. I think I'll give him a raise. What are you making now, honey? Zero. I think I'll double it. Wait, I'll triple it. Austin went down to visit the neighbor and uh, came back with a jar of honey. Uh, the guy's got a honey farm down there. So, uh, yeah, you come running back up the driveway with this. So we'd like to say thank you to him for that. So I guess that about wraps it up for this week. Um, lots of progress here. Driveway done. Got the deck done. And uh, hopefully next time we have a tent to show you. So thanks for stopping in, checking in on us. Uh, and we'll uh, see you next time. Bye-bye. Love you, Mom.